Sister Hafsa, read the first sentence and put, give the proper vowel signs. Kasarat teflu al-kalama. Huh? See now, can you see kasara? Teflu, the child broke. Broke what? You can see, you can ask a question and you get an answer. So, kasara is your verb and atiflu marfu is your file and then mafulun bihi has to be mansu. Are you with me? See, now you will vowelize it properly. Huh? Kalama. Kasarat teflu al-kalama. Sister Sumaya. Mindila, mashallah, mashallah. Gasalat aminatu al mindila. So where is the file? Aminatu. Huh? Because in this, we are specifying putting one line under file and two lines under mafulun bihi. But gasala is your fail, tau, tanisi, and then aminatu is your file, and mindila is your mafulun bihi. Sister Naima. Akala, Usama, Usama tu, file, huh? and then Inaba, Inaba, huh? grape. Huh? So Inaba is your mafulun bihi, Usama tu is your file. So you can put one line under Usama and two lines under Inaba. Wa, Akalat, and what is the next word? Zaujatu. Who? Zau jatu hu. What kind of a compound is this? Mudaf mudafili. So first, zau jatu is the file. Wa huwa mudaf. And hu mudafili. Got the idea? And is there a mafulun bihi? What is the mafulun bihi? Al mauza. Masha'Allah. Masha'Allah. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? Inshallah. Sister Sukhaina? Ha, sharibatil bakaratu al ma'ar. Now, why do you say sharibatil? Because there are two sukuns. Huh? Brothers and sisters, look at this. It comes in the lesson later on. Sharibata. And then, al bakaratu. Are you with me? Sharibat. Sharibat. Al Bakaratu. Now, because this is Hamzatul Wasal, I cannot pronounce it. Huh? Because there is something in front of it. There is a word in front of it. Now, here is a sukun, and Lam has a sukun, so there are two sukuns. And you cannot pronounce them. Two sukuns cannot be pronounced. We call it Iltikai Sakinaini. Meeting of two sukuns. Now, in order to pronounce them, the, the first sukun will always get a kasra, temporary. Now pronounce. Sharibatil, huh? then you can, from T you can go to Al. Now you can pronounce them, brother. Are you with me? So that is what it is. Huh? Now in, in Quran this comes, and those who do not know language, they will never know why Kasra came. Hmm? And we know that this Kasra is not original. It is a temporary thing. It was used to, it was used to pronounce the word properly. Are you with me? So Tao Tanis is still there. Now, you, when they give you Kasra, they don't put Sukun in the Quran. So you will read Sharibatil Bakratu, and you will have no idea what is this Sharibati. <laughs> you have no idea. But with the knowledge of language, you know that it is temporary. That is Tao Tanisi with a Sukun. Huh? And we give it a kasra so that we can now join uh, two words together. Sister Arifa, huh? 
Haan, very nice sentence. Hafiza Hamzatul Qur'ana. Uh, where is the file? Sister Arifa? Hamzatul. Oh, what is this al Quran doing here? Mafulun bihi. Because ask a question, no? Hafiza Hamzatul. Hamza memorized. Memorize what? You get the answer. al Quran, And that is your mafulun bi. Now I am only doing this for you to understand that there is a way of finding mafulun bi. But you will become so strong that you will be able to identify it without any difficulty, brothers and sisters. Okay? Now, Sister Aisha, Darabat Fatimatu Bintaha Mashallah Mashallah. See, Bintaha is a compound. How many words are there? What, are, what is the compound? Mudaf, Mudafilihi. Got the idea? How will you analyze it now? Sister Aisha, Daraba, Fiel, Ta, Tautanisi. Where is the file? Ah, Minatu, where is Mafulun Bihi? Binta, wahua, mudaf, and ha, mudaf ilayhi. Got the idea, brother and sister? MashaAllah, that is excellent. So here, darabat came. Huh? Properly, darabat came. There is no need to give kasra, because the next word doesn't start with sukun. But if it was al, huh, then we would have put a, suku, put a kasra there, you know. In Darabati. Okay. Inshallah, more example will come. Sister Ramuna? Ha, mashallah. Where is the fiel? Katala. Where is the file? And where is the mafulun bihi? And bil hajri? Jahan majru. Khalas. Mashallah. Okay, brothers and sisters, this is a very funny thing. I always tell in the class, from now onwards, see how many snakes are being killed in the book. Okay, you will count huh, now. This is snake number one. What is it, brother? Keep your count. Huh? We had a young fellow last time in our class, Brother Kazim. He got a, he got a nickname, Kazim Dynamite. Because he was very brilliant. He was only 12 year old. But mashallah, mashallah, he, he was very brilliant. And he did book through all the things. And his parents uh, took uh, him out of the school for one year. And he completed the course. Now he's back to his normal schooling. But he was very, very sharp. Huh? So he used to keep count. I said, Kazim, how many snakes are now? <laughs> So, here it is our first snack, brother. Sister uh, uh, Nasreen, Samia Bilalun, that is your file. Al Azana, wa Zahaba ila al Masjidi. MashaAllah. Now we are going to figure out here. Samia, Fial, Bilalun is file. Mashallah. And then what is wa? Ataf. And then? Fial. Where is the file? Mashallah. It mustatir. And then you will say, Takdiruhu huwa. And then we will say in Arabic, Yadullu ala. I will write down. Huh? Yadullu. Allah. Do not be, you know, gabrified with Yadullu Allah. Dalla Yadullu, we are going to study this verb later on, means it is pointing. Pointing to what? Zahaba, the file in Zahaba points to what? Bilal. So you will say, Yadullu Allah Bilalin. What will you say? Yadullu Allah Bilalin. Why Bilalin? Harf jar isam majroor. Ya dullu ala. I will tell, write down here. 
we la lin. Huh? This is how we'll say. I'll repeat and we'll be repeating. Zahaba fiel, fa'il, damirun, mustatirun. Taqdiruhu huwa. Ya dullu ala bilalin. And whatever the case is, inshallah. And then, ilal masjidi, jar majru. Very good. Sister uh, Mainaz. Masha'Allah. Kataba. What is Kataba? And Al Mudarisu? Ask a question. Mudaris wrote. Wrote what? And you get the answer. So, Adar Sa. It cannot be Dar Si. It cannot be Dar Su. It has to be Dar Sa. Mafulun bihi. Always, always Mansu. Okay? Kataba Al Mudarisu Dar Sa. Allah Saburati. What is Allah Saburati? Jan Panchur. Fine. Nam, Sister Nusrat. Yes. Saminati. Fine. Where is the verb? Where is the file? Al Bakkalu, the green grocer. Bakkalu, green grocer. Fataha Bakkalu. Huh? Where is Mafulun Bihi? Adukana. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Fine. Fi Asati is a majru. And what is Thaminati? Naat. Mashallah. Mashallah. At huh? 8 o'clock. Huh? He opened the bakkal, the green grocer, opened the shop at 8 o'clock. Very good. Brother number 5. It is very beautiful exercise, but now it requires thinking. Now it requires more vocab from you. Okay? Akmil, complete. Al jumla la tiyata. Bi kalimatin muna sibatin. Wad the bitha. Bi shakli. Means, brothers and sisters, that you vowelize it. Okay? You vowel, put proper vowel signs on it, you know. Vowelize it properly, brother. Man fataha al Man fataha al You can also say, Man fataha al kitab. Man fataha al kitab. Anything you can say. Huh? Okay? You got the idea? Fine. Okay, now we come to Brother Hassan. Number two. Gasalat, mashallah. Gasalat. Ukhti. Almindi. La, mashallah, mashallah. Gasalat, ukhti. Almindi. La, mafulun bihi. So, where is the verb? Gasala only. Huh? And then there is a tau tanisi. Where is the file? Ukhti is two words. Mudaf, mudaf ilayhi. So where is the file? Ukhtu. Wa huwa mudaf. And ya mutakallim? Mudaf. You got the idea? Huh? You, when you see mudaf, mudaf ilayhi, then you got to separate them and say the thing which is file. Huh? Are you with me, Sister Hafsa? Sister Sumaya, you understand, inshallah? Very good. Okay, brother. Other uh, uh, Abdul Samad. Katala Rajula Rajulul Hayata Bil Asa. Bil Asa. Stick. Danda. Okay, brother and sister. Snack number two. <laughs> are you are you counting? I should not remind you, you should count, huh? Katala Rajulul Hayata Bil Asa. So what is the katala? Fiel a rajulu file al hayata mafulun bilasa jar majulu. Brother Muhammad Shariba Yusufa al Kahwa. Why will you say Yusufa? Shariba Yusuf Fu. Why would you say Fa? No, there's no reason. It has to be Fu. Why Fu? 
Why fu and not fi and not fa? Because it is a file. And file is always marfu. Marfu. File is always marfu. Remember, brothers and sisters, if you make a little error here and there, don't worry. Maful and bihi will come later. Huh? But then if we make a mistake, we are all human beings. Huh? Uh, we are learning. We are bound to make some mistakes. Uh, you should not be, you know, you should not blame yourself. You know, just we learn from our mistakes and make ourselves more perfect. Very good, Sister Afsa. Yes. Saburati, Masha. This is easy. Katabal Mudarisu Darsa. Now you see, if you read your lessons very well, all the answers will come to you. They will be on your fingertips if you read the lesson very well. Okay? Now number six. Suada is is a Suada is a sister's name. Huh? So Sumaya, what will you say? Khubza. What is Khubz? Bread. Okay. What will you say? Will she drink or will she eat the bread? Akala. What would you say now? It's a feminine. Akalat. What will you say? Akalat. Why would you say akalat? Because the file is muannas. Suad is akalat suadu al khubza. Suadu al khubza. Got the idea? Translation, swad ate the bread. Huh? Fine. Sister Fatima, do you think you can handle it? Karatu, I read. Read what? Al darsa, al kitaba, al qurana, anything you want to say. Karatu, al darsa. I read the lesson. Karatu al qurana, I read the Quran. Karatu, I read. Read what? You need an answer. And that answer is your mafulun bihi. MashaAllah. Sister Naima. <laughs> what will you say? Samayatu? Then you are asking yourself. Asamiyata. Asamiyata. Al-Azana. Ya Hamza. Did you, how will you translate? Asanti. So asamiyata. So samiya. Huh? Samiya. Where is the verb, brother? Samiya. Huh? With a sukun. Remember. This is your verb. Samiya ta. And then alaza na. Sahi, brother and sister. Very good. Sister Sukhaina. Fatahat tajiru dukkana. Mashallah, that was very good. Tajiru is your file, dukan is your mafulun bihi. Now, sister Arifa. Huh? What did you say? Kharajat tullabu. So, what is the verb? Kharaja. Where is the file? Tullabu. Huh? And then, Miral. Firstly, what kind of a verb is this? It is lazim. Huh? Says Arifa, it does not need mafulun. Try to ask a question. Kharaja Tullabu. Tullabu went out. Asse, went out what? <laughs> you don't get the answer. So this is fair lazim. Intransitive. Okay? MashaAllah. Ij al kullan min al kalimati la atiyati. Mafulun bihi. Wadbit. Akhiraha. Okay. Brothers well, and sisters, Ij'al, make. Huh? All the following words into mafulun bihi and vowelize it. The end of it. So you'll have to make a new sentence. Uh, whose turn is now? Sister Aisha. Make a nice sentence in which you can use Quran as mafulun bihi. Mashallah. See, karatu al Quran. So, where is the verb, Sister Aisha? Kara. With, no, not tu. Tu is your file. Kara, with sukun. Remember, it's not kara, but kara. 
Are you with me? When you write down, where is the verb? Kara. With sukun. That is your verb. Okay? And what is to? File. And then, where is the mafulun bihi? al Qur'a na. Are you with me, brother and sister? Karatul Qur'ana. Translation, sister Aisha? I read the Qur'an. See, now things are getting more interesting. You are using your mafulun being and understanding it, inshallah. Sister Maimuna, kahwatu. Sharibtu kahwata, mashallah. Sharibtu kahwata. Or you can say, Sharib uh, hamidun kahwata, whatever you want to say. But that was your sentence, absolutely correct. Uh, where is the verb? Sharib. Only sharib with sukun. Huh? Okay, and two is the five. Sister Nasreen, tufahu. Yeah, what did you say? Akala atufaha. Translation? Mashallah. See? Akala tufaha. He ate the apple. Akal tu ayat. But when you say akala tufaha, he ate the apple. Where is the file? Where is the file? Mustatil. Takadiruhu huwa khalas. Sister Mayras. Fatahtu al Baba. I opened the door. Or you can say, you can change the file. Instead of we saying two, two, two all the time, you can say, Fatahat aminatu al Baba. Or Fatahal waladu al Baba. The boy opened the door. Something, you know. You have a choice, but when you say Fatahatu al Baba, it's absolutely correct. Nusrat? Huh? You are asking, or she's asking a question. Afahintat darsa? What is the translation? Did you understand the lesson? Mashallah. Afahintat darsa? Mashallah, mashallah. Where is the fiel? Fahim, with sukun. Where is the file? Ta. And where is Mafulun bihi? Darsa. Mashallah. Mashallah. Brother Hassan. Al Kami. Mashallah. Mashallah. Gasalat Ummi Al Kamisa. Translation, brother? My mother washed the Mashallah. Beautiful. See, my mother washed the shirt. Where is the uh, uh, fial? Where is the verb? Gasala. And what is the next thing? Tautanisi. Tautanisi. Huh? Where is the file? Ummu. Ummu. Ummi is two words. Ummi is compound. And what kind of a compound is this? Mudaf, mudafili. So if you, we have to choose one of the word as a file. Okay, so what is the file? Where is the file? Ummu. Wahua. Mudaf. And then, Ya Mutakalim. Mudaf. And Al Kami. Sa. Maf'ulun bihi. MashaAllah. MashaAllah. I think we will take a short break. Brothers and sisters, we start now. Now we are learning another very, very important rule, brothers and sisters. So I will write down something on the board, huh, brother? Okay. What did I say, brothers and sisters? At-Talibu At-Talibu Zahaba Ilal Fasli Translation? Classroom What is At-Talibu, brothers and sisters? Mubtada Where is the Khabar? Jumla Feliya Is the Khabar Al Jumlatul Fialitu is the Khabar. Fine, but.
If I say at talibu mubtada, then what is zahaba? Fiel. Where is the file? Mustatir. Takdiruhu huwa. Yadullu ala talib. It is pointing out to, indicating it to the talib. Now I say at talibani. So what does, does it now means? Two students. A talibani is now mubtada. Is it marfu? Yes. yes. What is the sign of its marfu? Alif, mashallah. Why? Because it is dual. Okay. And then I have to put a proper verb. Are you with me? So, zahaba. Okay. Where is the verb? Zahaba. Where is the file? Alif, mashallah. Huh? Now I say to you, Atullahu. Zaha bu ilal fasli. What is the tulabu? Mubtada. Where is the khabar? Jumla failure. What is zahabu? Zahabu without wow is your fial. And where is the file? Wow. See, this is your fial and this is your file. I should not do this way. And then I keep the alif outside. Huh? Okay. By the way, what is this alif? Now I can explain you. What is noon? Nunu vikaya. What is this alif? Alifu vikaya. It protects the wall. See, before I, we could not go in detail. Now this is alifu vikaya. Huh? It protects the verb, okay? Wow, especially wow. Okay, brother, at What is at tullabu? Mubtada. Where is the news? Zahabu ilal fasli. So that is your jumla failure coming as a khabar. Where is the verb? Zahabu, without wow. And where is the file? Al wow. Now you see, when the mubtada starts, then you bring an appropriate word form to match the mubtada. Huh? Okay? Fine. Now we change it. So I say to you, Zahaba, Zahaba, Talibu, Ilal, Fasli. What kind of a sentence is this now? What was what kind of a sentence was this? Jumla ismiya. Huh? Now we start straight away. Jumla filia. Where is the verb? Where is the file? Talibu. Huh? Now I have to say here. Tali bani. Two students are going. Now what kind of a verb I use? Huh? Shall I say zahaba? Because there are two students, no, I will still say Zahaba. What happened if I said Zahaba Atalibani? Uh, if I say Zahaba, then there is a file in Aleph, there is a file as an Aleph, and there is a file here. How can you have two files? So we have to use a singular verb. Okay? Now we say atullabu. What kind of verb shall I use? What form of verb? Again zahaba. Okay? Many of you will be tempted to say zahabu atullabu. What you will be tempted. Uh, because you say it's a, it's a jama, so I use use jama. If you say zahabu, atullabu, brother and sisters, you got a file here, and you got a file here. You can't have two files in a sentence. So, what do we understand out of it? We understand out of it that if you start a new sentence. What did I say? 
you start a brand new sentence and if the verb is in third person what kind of a verb is in third person brother whoa homa whom here homa hunna these are third person okay okay and all of them have a verb forms okay zahaba zahaba zahabu zahabat zahabata zahabna okay but if you start a fresh sentence uh, and if the file is third person third person uh, huwa huma hum ya huma hunna okay then the verb is always singular did you get it see here zahaba talibu zahaba talibani zahaba tulabu the verb is singular only in the beginning of a new sentence ha huh? same change it now zahaba zahabat atalibatu zahabat atalibatani zahabat atalibatu are you with me make it more nice you want me to write it yes. i will write it ha huh? okay okay i will say here zahabat at tali batu and then i will say zahabat at tali batani now mind you, you you will have to say zahabat at tali batu are you with me zahabat at tali you you know that huh? you know that huh? okay zaha bat at tali batu are you with me man so what is the rule that you start a new sentence and if the file happens to be gaib in third person huh then whether it is singular dual or plural you will use the verb in the first form in the singular form huh and then if you have to say more things about that file then you will use an appropriate form okay so here is huh? the student went to the class and sat what did i say the student went to the class and sat okay uh, i'm i just have to now remove this brother zahaba talibu ila al fasli و جلسا now you come to zahabat talibani ila al fasli wa jalasa now you will use the proper verb wa jala sa zahabat tulabu ila al fasli wa jalasu because now we have to use the proper verb form wa jala su now change that brother zahabat ha huh? maybe i should write down here brother and sisters in order to make it very clear ha huh? zahabat talibatu are you with me zahabat 
التالي بتاني and then I write down here ذهبت التالي باتو now what will happen here brother ذهبت التالي باتو then I will say و جلست جلست now if I say ذهبت الطالبة تاني و جلستا what will I say و جلستا how do you with me brothers and sisters now you say ذهبت الطالبة باتو و جلسنا و جلسنا Is it clear, brother and sister? This will happen. Are you listening to me, brother and sisters? This will happen only in third person. That's all. In a third person, when you start a new sentence, you will always start with a singular verb. Mudakkar or muannas. That's it. Mudakkar or muannas. Always. And then, afterwards, when you continue, then you will use the proper form, referring to the file before. Referring to the file before. See? Zahabat talibatu. So it's a singular. Huh? So you say, jalasat. You will say, jalasat. Okay? Now you say, zahabat a talibatani and then now you will look at this and you say jalasata now you say zahabat singular muannas zahabat a talibatu and then you will say wa you will look at this and use the word jalasna let's go to muzakkar zahabat talibu wa Jealous. I look at this file and use the word. Zahabat Talibani wa Jalasa. Now Jalasa refers to Talibani. Zahabat Tullabu wa Jalasu. See, here singular and there the appropriate verb to match the file, you know which was before. Are you with me, brother and sister? Sister Nasri? Inshallah. Uh, brother and sister, it is easy to understand and it is easy to forget. Huh? And what will make you very strong? When you will write it. Huh? When you write it, it will make you strong. Varna, we understand and tomorrow we forget. Huh? But if you write it, Inshallah, you will master it. One more time. It is only for third person. Whether it is Muzakkar or Muannas, when you start a new sentence, the first verb form is singular. Only when you start a new sentence. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Yes. Now, here is number seven. Tamal Musalaini Atiyaini. Okay? Ponder the following two examples. Atullabu si mubtada. What is tullabu? Mubtada. Now you got to have appropriate verb. Zahabu ilal malabi. Fine. Under. Change that to jumla failure. You will start with a zahabat, not zahabu. Zahabat. Tullabu. If you started with Zahabu, you will end up with having two files. And you can't have that. Okay? Inshallah. Now, At-Talibatu. What is it, brothers and sisters? At-Talibatu. Zahabna. What is the Talibatu? Muftada. Zahabna. 
Are you with me, brother and sisters? Now change it, brother, into jumla failure. You will have to say, Zahabat atalibatu. Zahabat atalibatu. Did you understand the rule, brother and sisters? Inshallah. It's not difficult. One more time I repeat. It is for third person. You will start with a singular verb. Huh? Fine. <clears throat>